we are going to see a beautiful first day of fall and it's feeling like it for today. Here's some of those live looks across the state. You can see in the upstate looking pretty clear right now there in Clemson. As for Columbia and Sumter, some heavy cloud cover as well as near the coast. Now this is all due to tropical storm Ophelia, which made landfall in North Carolina early this morning. That's bringing us some gusty winds today. Right now in Lexington, about 12 miles an hour, 10 in Columbia, 14 in Sumter and in St. Matthews. Taking a closer look at our winds forecast for today, we're going to see gusts possibly up to 25 miles an hour. Those winds will calm down at points, but could pick up once again. Now, along with these gusty winds, temperatures are not warming up much due to the cloud cover we're seeing. So right now on the very first day of fall, just 71 degrees in Columbia, 73 in Orangeburg, 67 in Sumter, 76 in Greenville and down by the coast in the lower 70s. Here's a look at your forecast for today. We're not going to warm up much at all, actually. 73 degrees is the forecast by 1 p.m. Again, due to this heavy cloud cover that we're seeing. 75 degrees by 3 p.m., 76 near 5 p.m. Now, I know tonight is the game in williams Bryce Stadium. Mississippi State is taking on the Gamecocks. It's going to be a little bit cooler. Don't forget that the sun is also setting earlier now, so you're not going to have that sunshine to provide you warmth. So around kickoff, 72 degrees, and along with this, remember, we have those strong winds, so I would advise to bring a jacket. I also get cold easily. We're taking a look at our satellite radar, Tropical Storm Ophelia, there in North Carolina right now, still maintaining tropical storm status with some strong winds. Here's a look at our forecast models where you can see these outer rain bands might bring some areas in the Midlands some rain. Again, mainly just the eastern side closer to the tropical storm itself. Lee, Sumter, Clarendon all seeing rain possibilities in the mid-afternoon. And this rain could stick around for a little bit by Clarendon at 2.30 p.m. Still seeing a chance of rain, but the good news is as we continue throughout much of our day, we clear out. But again, no clouds in the sky. We're not trapping in any heat. That's really going to allow temperatures to cool down tonight. Here's a look at your seven day forecast. First day of fall today with a high temperature just in the mid 70s. Mostly cloudy skies, but conditions do improve for Sunday. Sunny skies, a high temperature in those mid 80s. Looking towards our next work week, 85 degrees on Monday, not too bad, but we'll begin to cool back down as rain comes into the forecast by midweek.